from what I understand, I think the Army is the most lax. Marine is pretty strict, and Navy is kind of in the middle. Or that's how it used to be. So much so, many tattoo shops, like Element Tattoo on Fredericksburg Road, have military-themed artwork showing what they can do. With a lot of service personnel, it's almost tradition. And those are the youngsters, but also there's older veteran military people that come in and get tattooed on a regular basis as well. That may soon change, however. The military is cracking down on ink. Above the neck, prohibited, and then no sleeves. Lieutenant Colonel Britt Hopper is in charge of San Antonio area recruiters. He says new regulations, which went into effect just last month, put strict guidelines on appearance. It's about honoring the uniform um, and, how we, and you know, how we look and present ourselves in that uniform. Hopper says the military is a profession, and they want their soldiers to look that way. During the 12 years of war in Iraq and Afghanistan, the military eased restrictions on tattoos and branding, which allowed some people in. But now, with budget cuts and the Army reducing its numbers, potentially to pre-World War II levels, they could be a lot more discriminating. You can go out and get a tattoo, you know, while you're in the, while you're in the Army, but, uh, you know, However, certain areas you can't get them.